Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Security Lock feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Basically, it's something that Google initiated back in Android 5 to where when an, when an Android device is now factory reset without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's then going to ask you to log into that account again as a security measure after the reset has been performed. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Samsung Galaxy Tab A. This is one of their smaller models that just has a six inch screen, but this device does have the Google account lock enabled because as we can see here, as we go through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that it was reset and to continue, we have to sign in with the previous Google account that was on it. And at first glance, there doesn't appear to be any way to get past that if you don't actually have the login information for that account. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information, or because they were sold the device by a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the lock was enabled, and after the purchase, the buyer discovered the device was locked and they didn't have the login information, the seller had long since disappeared, and unfortunately it's a very common scam that happens all the time these days with the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to remove the lock from this specific model without having to have the previous login information. It's something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this procedure is that it's something that we can do for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection, and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we did to this one. So before making the video, we had actually already done 99% of the work so we can keep this as short and sweet as possible. So I'm just gonna show you to verify again that the Google Lock is up on the screen so that you can see that we're not gonna try to trick you by signing in with our own account or anything like that. And now that all the work has been completed, I should just be able to hit the back button once. Yep, and there we go. So the device skipped right to the home screen through all the rest of the setup steps, and we now have full access to all the apps and settings and features, and it's just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. Now again, that's not gonna work for you if you try it because we had already done 99% of the necessary steps ahead of time. Now I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we're working with. So in the About Device section here, we can see that we do have a Galaxy Tab A, this one came out back in 2016, but that model number there, the T280, that's the specific model device that we are working with here. So if you have one of these devices and need help getting the Google Lock removed from it, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all of the details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices. And I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Hitting the subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.